What's going on guys, Dippin' Diesel back. We're gonna be taking a look at three light bars from MIG Tuning. Uh, they sent over three light bars for me to look at, to play around with, uh, and let you guys know what is on the market for good, affordable light bars. We're gonna crack into this first one right here. I got two 22 inch light bars and then a 42 inch light bar. You guys already know I got the MIG Tuning uh, light bar on the front of my truck already. Um, that one is a 42 inch curved light bar. I believe it is 240 watts. Um, this one right here is a, I wrote it, I wrote it down because, you know, I can't remember everything uh, with these light bars. So this one is the GN V2 series. It is the Blue Cross 120 watts. So let's break right into this thing. First get it, you're gonna be getting a uh, wiring harness, mounting bracket, the switch. The switch is already on there, so you got the switch, you got the wiring harness, you got the mounting brackets, and then you have the light bar. So like I said, like I said, this is a 22 inch light bar called the Blue Cross. Looking at it right now, and you can actually see why it's called the Blue Cross. Um, it has these crosses which light up blue. I believe this whole light bar lights up blue. Um, so if you guys have a blue truck, that would really set it off with that light bar. I will be going into further detail with these own videos. So there'll be a video on this light bar, video on this light bar, and then a video on the 42 inch light bar. This is just to show you guys some light bars that Mike Tuning has, or Mick Tuning, please. I'm not sure how to say it, Mike Tuning or Mick Tuning. I think it's Mike Tuning or Mick Tuning. I'm really not sure. Nevertheless, this is a sick looking light bar. Um, yeah, so if you guys want to see videos on these individually, um, hit subscribe and you will see videos coming out in the near future. We're going to set this one aside and take a look at the second 22 inch light bar that they sent over for me. So this one is the DB3 series, it's 135 watt triple row with an amber with amber lights on the side. I think this one is a pretty sick looking light bar. You're gonna get a wiring harness. You're actually gonna get two wiring harnesses. One is to turn on the, um, the amber lights on the side and then one is to turn on the middle light, I believe. So you're gonna get this one to turn on the amber lights on the side and then it comes with a switch for the middle. Obviously you're gonna get some mounting brackets for it. And then the main event is this light bar. So this is a really cool design. Uh, I believe this is the first design that I've seen like this. Like, I mean, I don't really search around for light bars too often, but this one is pretty dang cool. So you're gonna get the light bar in the middle and then you're gonna get these amber lights on the side. So like I said, you can turn it on with this light or with this switch. Got the on off and then got this one but i noticed about this i was reading online and it has a um a little breather breather right there so it lets out the condensation if it does get condensation in here it has a little breather valve to let all that all that um condensation out which is really really cool design actually you guys are in colder weather snows a lot rains a lot could get moisture in here that breather valve um Let's that moisture out. So that is a DB3 series, pretty cool design. I've never seen a design like that, um, which is pretty cool. So on to the last light bar that I have to show you guys today. Too many light bars been showing up in my house lately. Uh, this one is gonna be the R RGB series, 240 watt, 42 inch light bar. Uh, not much to say about that. You guys already know RGB. They, uh, it's a color changing light bar, so you can change it whatever color you want. Pull out your phone, it's Bluetooth. So pull out your phone, load the app up, and you can change whatever color you want. So you're gonna get a uh, wiring harness as expected. The Bluetooth controller. So I will, like I said, do a video on this if you guys wanna know how to set it up. Uh, mounting brackets. All that good stuff and then we got some instructions tells you guys what what app to get and um, how to set it up basically don't need that 
So here we go, the 42 inch RGB color changing light bar. It has a film on it right now, so uh, I'll pull that film off. I didn't pull the film off of that one. Probably should have for you guys so you can actually see the uh, lens, but go ahead and get this film off. Oh man. That is a sick looking light bar. So it has a sort of a, um, I don't know what to call it, not a honeycomb, but it has a different set of lenses right here, and then in the middle, and then right here as well with that light bar. So there you go, that is the 42 inch RGB color changing light bar. Uh, I am very curious to see all these lit up um, this one obviously is a color changing one. I'm very curious to see this one lit up because I've never seen a design like that uh, with a straight light bar in the middle and then uh, I'll pull this out for you guys. But that one is a cool design as well. And then we have this one. This one is a pretty cool design as well. So does that have a film on it? No, it does not. So there we go, we got three light bars for you guys. There will be a link in the description if you guys wanna go check these out. Uh, if you guys wanna wait for the actual review on these um, to be able to pick one up, um, go ahead and wait. Or if you guys wanna go pick one up right now, link in the description. Uh, big thanks to Mike Tuning for sending these over for me to review. Like I said, this is just an unboxing to show you guys what light bars I have. Yeah, so. Go check them out. Be on the lookout for new videos. Um, I have a colder intake showing up today, actually. About 8.14 right now, so I'm going to sleep. Uh, but yeah, guys, pretty cool. Big thanks to them for sending this over. And uh, be on the lookout for videos on each one of these. That's pretty much all I got to say, guys. Hopefully you guys uh, go check them out. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace.